hey guys so my book kind of took over my social media the past few weeks but we are back with the burn research study day three which was pretty much the same as day one and two except i forgot to show you all this thermal scale which they used to kind of ask me how hot i'm feeling at different points during the study and how much energy i feel like i'm exerting which was usually warm and not much energy at all most interesting thing about today was definitely this because I got to see with my own eyes just how badly my sweat pores were affected by my burns and my skin grafts. Just the non-burned skin in this top row. Okay, okay. Here's the burned skin that has not been grafted okay. and burned skin that was subsequently grafted. Mm -hmm. So if you look at the healthy skin, there's mm -hmm. nothing really happening at the zero time True. point, so there's no sweating going mm -hmm, on. Mm -hmm. But if we look at the last two time points, you see there's hundreds of dots here yeah, on I the non-burned skin. Yeah, and yeah, what yeah. those dots represent is an active sweat gland. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. And we can see that there's there's some active sweat glands yeah. on the burned skin that has not been grafted. Mm -hmm. But if we look at the entire spectrum on the grafted skin, there's no sweat nothing glands activated, wow. which explains some kind of thermal intolerance mm -hmm, during exercise, mm -hmm. especially in warm environments. Oh, that's really interesting. Day four, AKA final day of the burn research study. Uh, I got to the Institute and they checked my heart as was routine. And then we went into the room, the warm room where we started the session. And today was special because I got to meet their boss who is basically the one who's, I guess, spearheading this research. And uh, he thanked me for coming, which was really cool. I thanked him for having me. And then I walked as I always do and uh, drank a lot of water and they sprayed me with a lot of water and then they checked my heart after we were done with the hour and that was it guys i said goodbye to josh and the others and i was gone that is it guys um hopefully this was interesting and informative to everyone of y'all not just burn survivors that follow me but um i hope something good comes out of this research thank you to the institute for having me yeah thanks guys for um following me on this journey it's my first time doing a vlog type of thing so I hope it was interesting. <laughs>